We got to move on to another local story here in Chicago. It's uh, hilarious, but it also shows uh, just how corrupt our system is. It's, it's another sad chapter in corrupt Chicago politics. So, Daniel, lead it away. So, this is a pretty quick one. So, we have Alderman Joel Moreno. The first ward has been accused of uh, impersonating a police officer, and um, a woman was parked in a, a street. He was not happy with how she was parked. So he basically pulled out a badge and said, uh, you have to move. I am the, you know, respect my authority. And she, uh, she left, but she also was like, that guy didn't seem like a cop. So she called the police and put out a report, and it turns out it was uh, Alderman Joe Moreno just telling the citizen what to do without uh, the actual authority to do so. Okay, so the one thing I got to ask, the, 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 the one thing I want to ask is, like, did he pull out, like, a cereal box police badge or some sort of fake police badge? Yeah, wh- uh, where did he yeah, get it's this an, badge? Yeah. It's an honorary badge that they give to aldermen. Really? His alderman's honorary badge? That means nothing. Holy cow. Wow. What wow. we're looking at is a picture of a uh, badge that says City of Chicago Alderman. Okay. And it's more like an idea. It's like, I'm the alderman. It's not okay. like I'm the sheriff. <laughs> All right, well, see, here's the thing, people. I want everyone to remember, in 2019, we're going to have the municipal election. And if you don't like how this alderman represents uh, you, especially in your ward, uh, now's the time for new leadership. If he's pulled out a badge that he doesn't really have any authority behind and acted like there was authority behind it. Yeah, now's the time to get, uh, you know, a vote in somebody else because if he's willing to do something that sleazy, I only can imagine what else he's doing. It's Chicago politics. And it's just another sad chapter in our city's history with government and our corrupt officials. So that being said, we're going to move on to a more serious...